welcome back to Penny Feathers. I'm Penny Downs and today I wanted to check in with you all to see how you're getting on during this weird and wonderful COVID-19 time. So I hope that everyone is keeping well, keeping positive and enjoying time at home because after all being at home saves lives and that's the only thing that we can do to help each other. I hope that you've watched the past video about Dr. Murad and cultural stress, as I really, really feel at the moment, it's so apparent to each and every one of us. And I just wanted to say, you know, don't forget about his four pillars. So don't forget to eat your water, be kind to your mind, exercise and look after your skin. The more we can keep ourselves healthy, we can become a healthier person. After all, we are everything we put into our body. And I think at the moment we've got the best time to reflect and to adjust and to build new habits so that when we are allowed back out into normal life, those habits are long lasting. Um, so enough about my lecture about keeping healthy and enjoying life. Let's get on to my product of today. So today I'm concentrating on the eye area with our renewing eye cream. This comes under the serum range of Murad, so a step two from our resurgence and is suitable for all skin types and all ages. And it's a multi-active product. So it doesn't just do one thing, it does numerous things. And it's a product that is very popular in salon. I love it myself. And I feel that eye creams aren't always the thing that we go to, but I do feel purely believe that we should look after our eye area. So let's have a little chat. Our eye area is a lot thinner than our main face, so we always find that eye creams are very, very light weight in texture, and again, less is more. M lots of you hear me say in salon, when you're applying an eye cream, make sure it's no bigger than a grain of uncooked basmati rice, split between two fingers, and gently pushed around the eye bone. Okay, and then smooth. You don't want to overpack your eyes because they're going to swell, they'll look great, but when the eye, when the product is diminished the eyes are, lines are going to get worse so less is more with eye cream and you want to put it on every morning and night under your moisturizer but over your serum okay um your eye cream especially your renewing eye cream is a active product so it will need a sunscreen over the top i team this with the bit c eye cream which has got an spf 15 in um but that would only be in the daytime at night i just apply my moisturizer over the top Choice of moisturiser for me at the moment is the Nutrient Charge Water Gel morning and night. And then I have been using my Invisible Earth Factor 30 over the top, but the sun's out now. So I'm going for the Factor 50 from Murad, the City Block, as I just feel I need a little bit more. So let's talk about what the magic ingredients in here are. So this is multi-active. So it's there just to um, help fight our dark circles and our lines and wrinkles as well. It has soya bean in there to help um, hydrate the skin. It has caffeine in there to stimulate the circulation to diminish the dark circles. And it has um, a very soothing complex in it from Dr. Murad to help hydrate, lift and firm. So that's our renewing eye cream. It's a true hero and it is one of the original products that Murad bought out. Um, if you've got a review, put it underneath. If you've got anything to say about eye creams, do let me know. I have started using eye creams in the last five years as it was one of those things when I got to 30, I thought, oh goodness me, I need to start looking after my eye area. And I truly, truly believe that my eyes do look better from using an eye cream. So although they can be a little bit more um, money, they are worth every penny. And with a Dr. Murad one, you're going to get a good nine to 10 months out of it. So it is, you know, a powerful eye cream. It's consistent in results and it's well worth having in your regime. So going to let you go for today. Thanks so much for listening. Um, as always, reach out on um, social media or drop me an email. Details will be below and I hope you're keeping well. Thanks a lot. Bye.